Our question today is Michael, should I be open to owner financing when I sell my building? Well, look, that depends on your individual situation. Uh, if you own the pr property personally and you're selling it, uh, you've got to make sure that you can supply the property free and clear of debt if you're going to own or finance it. Um, and it depends on what you're going to do with the money, right? So if you're going to do a 1031 exchange and you're going to buy other property, then you may not want to own or finance it. But let's say you're going to sell that property and you're going to put that money in a safe investment somewhere that might have a pretty low return. Um, then you may want to consider owner financing because now you might get a better return. You have a, a collateral that you're familiar with that hopefully over time is going up in value. There's some safety uh, precautions to take when you're holding owner financing. You know, make sure that the buyer slash borrower puts down enough down payment uh, to make it safe, make sure it's managed well, maintained well, that you have proper documentation on your note and security deed and things. But we've seen uh, cases where some sellers that will only sell with owner financing and they'll have a lockout provision that the loan can't be prepaid because they really want to do an installment sale on their taxes, save some tax dollars, they have the income from the interest on the, on the loan. Uh, so for a lot of sellers, owner financing can be a great way to go. If we might be of service, you're invited to reach out to us. Ask Michael Bull is brought to you by these great companies. To discover more about their benefits and services, visit CREshow.com.